Hey, what's going on, guys? Me, So, today, I wanted to give you guys a little story time, because I was thinking, man, you know, I could do a video on some, something scientific, I could do something else, but I, I decided, you know what? No. Let's experiment, okay? I really wanted to start doing story times. I think I did it before, and then I kind of just dropped the idea later. But yeah, now I think I'm going to get back into doing more story time. So yeah, here we go. All right, so the first story we have, um, first of all, you know, don't quote me on any of these things. All right, this isn't, this could have happened to me, could happen to somebody else that I've heard, and this could be passed down from one of my friends, some of one of my family. So like, don't really think that it's all me doing this, okay? So basically like one day, you know, but then I'm always going to be in the first person point of view. So then, yeah, it's going to be a little bit weird, but don't take everything I say seriously, okay? Because usually when people tell me the story, they'll be in first person, they'll be in first person point of view. So then I'll just think of me experiencing the story. That's kind of how I go through it. But yeah, all right. So basically what happens is at one point, it's like the last day of school. It's summer. We're kind of just there, just chilling out. And then, you know, we're, we're just like in our classrooms, just talking. And basically we're, 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 we're like ready to go, right? Or not the last day of summer. So the last day of school before summer starts, all right? We're in seventh grade, we're just at home, and then we just finish. We're like we're in like the last day, where it's like the three hour day classes, where it's like right before lunch. You gotta get out. If, if my friends are watching this, you guys know what I'm, you guys know what I'm talking about because you guys have been through this with me. But it was like we have like twelve twenty release days. That's what that's what we used to call it. We go at eight. We get released by twelve twenty. We go through all six classes like that. It's like twenty minutes each, and then we go through lunch and break and everything. And it's like everybody's just getting ready to get into that summer mode and just get out of here, right? So this is in seventh grade, and we're just in class, and then our teacher's just talking to us, like, hey, you know what, guys, like, you know, great job this year, you know, you guys did amazing, and we're just kind of watching, like, a little uh, cartoon movie, and then we're just taking a chill, people brought snacks, and we're just chilling, having fun. Now, what ended up happening was, suddenly, like, we didn't know if it was a drill or anything, but then we, we hear the lockdown sound go off. So then we're just thinking, okay, well, this is a little bit odd, right? We're like, okay, why would they do this? Are they testing it on the last day? Because usually we have these drills. We just test it out, and then our teachers get really mad, so they're just like, oh, screw this. Just turn off all the lights, and then you just say, you know what, pull out your notes and start reading or something. And so they just try to sneak that part of the curriculum into there, so then they, just, to make it, just to make it productive. They know it's a drill. But this time, the teachers didn't know it was a drill. So our teacher was basically saying, like, so then he, he's, he's an English teacher. He's really chill, great guy. It's like about his 40s or 50s. Dude loves Coke. So if you guys are watching, you guys know what I'm talking about. So yeah, what happens is we're just kind of chilling there. And then at the end of the day, you know, we're like, we're like ready to go home. And we get this lockdown thing. And he's saying, hey, man, I didn't. this was not in the schedule. You know, I did not have, I did not really have, um, I didn't get an email. Or I didn't have a voice call with anybody saying this. So he's like, all right, you know what, let's just go through it. So we turn off the lights and we go there. And then what ends up happening is um, we're just going through and then we've been locked down for a long time. And then it's been past 12, 20 when we're supposed to be released home. So we're just still locked down and we don't have, we have no idea what's going on. And then suddenly we just randomly hear that over at the high school, there's been a shooting. And we're like, there's a shooting? And they're like, no, it's a shooter. And it's like, hold all these weird little things going on. And then we realized that it's actually a bomb threat. So we were at school and then there was some random guy at the high school who didn't want to take a test. So he just called somebody and said, hey, you know, like, we placed a bomb in the school. So he called from like some kind of pay phone that's nearby. So then the cops were just able to trace that and they, they said, oh, hey, who's been here? And they were like, oh, two kids with, a, with some long hair and a denim jacket. And then they were like, okay. So then they just go by and then they literally see two kids with a denim jacket in class. And they literally match the exact same with the same shoes, his backpack and everything. And then they're like, hey, where were your kids out? And they're like, oh, we had a free lunch pass so we can walk out of school and come back. So they literally knew it was those two kids took him and then we asked him like they asked him hey what's been going on and they're like yeah we had a test in biology we didn't want to do it so we just ended up you know threatening to bomb the school so it's crazy but you know it's the end of the summer we're all ready to go home and it looks like those kids had finals so then they didn't want to do the finals and yeah it's wild man but at the end of the day we just learn from those experiences i have a lot more cool stories from school i'm gonna share another story tomorrow so make sure you guys are tuned for that too Alright, I think that's also going to be a lockdown story. So stay tuned. I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Brand new video. Bye.